China's South to North Water Transfer Project SNWTP, is one of the largest and most ambitious water diversion projects in the world. The project aims to transfer water from the Yangtze River in the south to the Yellow River Basin in the north, in order to alleviate water shortages in the north and improve water security for the country as a whole. The SNWTP is divided into three routes, the Eastern Route, the Central Route, and the Western Route. The Eastern Route is the most advanced and has been completed. It diverts water from the Yangtze River to the Haiha River and the Bohai Sea. The Central Route is currently under construction. It will divert water from the Danjianku Reservoir on the Han River to the Yellow River. The Western Route is still in the planning stages. It would divert water from the Qinghai Tibet Plateau to the northwest of China. The total cost of the SNWTP is estimated to be $62 billion. The project is expected to be completed in 2050. The SNWTP has a number of benefits. It will help to alleviate water shortages in the north, which are becoming increasingly severe due to climate change. It will also improve water security for the country as a whole. The project will also create jobs and boost economic development in the areas where it is being built. However, the SNWTP also has a number of environmental and social impacts. The construction of the project has displaced hundreds of thousands of people. The project has also been criticized for its potential to damage the environment, including the loss of wetlands and the degradation of water quality. Overall, the SNWTP is a controversial project. It has the potential to bring significant benefits to China, but it also has the potential to cause significant environmental and social damage. The project is still under construction, and it remains to be seen how its full impacts will be felt. Here are some additional facts and figures about the SNWTP. The project will divert up to 44.8 billion cubic meters of water annually. The eastern route is 1,138 kilometers long. The central route is 1,442 kilometers long. The western route is still in the planning stages, but it is estimated to be 3,000 kilometers long. The project is expected to create 10 million jobs. The project is expected to boost economic output by $100 billion per year. The SNWTP is a major undertaking, and it is still too early to say what its full impacts will be. However, it is clear that the project has the potential to have a significant impact on China's water security, economy, and environment. If you enjoyed this video leave a like and subscribe to Wonderful Stories, Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.